I did. Go for it. All yours. This is a, called The Children's Hour by Longfellow. Between the dark and the daylight, when the night is beginning to lower, comes a pause in the day's occupation that is known as the children's hour. I hear in the chamber above me the patter of little feet, the sound of a door that is opened, and voices soft and sweet. From the study, I see in the lamplight descending the broad hall stair, grave Alice and laughing Allegra and Edith with golden hair. A whisper, and then a silence. Yet I know by their merry eyes they are plotting and planning to take me, take me by surprise. A, a sudden rush from the stairway, a sudden raid from the hall. By two doors left unguarded, they enter my castle wall. They climb up into my turret or the arms in the back of my chair. If I try to escape this surrounding, they seem to be everywhere. Do you think, oh, blue-eyed vain diddy, because you have scaled the wall? Such an old mustache as I am is not a match for you all. I have you safe in my fortress and will not let you depart. But I lock you down in the dungeon, in the round tower of my heart. And there, I'll keep you forever. Yes, forever a day. Till the walls of my castle shall crumble and molder in dust away. I lost my place on that point. Yeah, you did all right, though. Made it through here. Yeah, I'll tell you what, that's beautiful. Longfellow. So when you... Yeah. When we're reading these things, mm -hmm. they, 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 we can make these moments happen for us at, at the particular moment, you know, that they're... Um, here's one by uh, Robert Frost. And this, sure, this is familiar to most of you, stopping by the woods on a snowy evening. Whose woods these are, I, I think I know. His house is in the village, though. He will not see me stopping here to watch his woods fill up with snow. My little horse must think it queer to stop without a farmhouse here. Between the woods and frozen lake, the darkest evening of the year, he gives his harness bells a shake to ask if there is some mistake. The only other sounds the sweep of easy wind and downy flake. The woods are lovely, dark and deep. But I have promises to keep, and miles to go before I sleep. And miles to go before I sleep. Uh, you're right. I remember that one well. Grandma.